Hey guys, welcome back to another very interesting video of our channel Versatile Knowledge. We all know Google Chrome has been the go-to web browser for any platform as such. If you take an instance of Android smartphones, Google Chrome has been the best browser on Android smartphone platform. And when it comes to the PCs or Mac or even Ubuntu computers, Google Chrome is one of the best browsers because of the amount of tools, plugins and extensions it provides to make your browsing experience better. And when it comes to Google Chrome, we all have faced this issue that Google Chrome uses a lot of RAM on your computers. On PC, the Google Chrome uses so much RAM that on some computers which has less memory like an 8GB RAM or a 4GB RAM or even we have seen computers with 2GB RAM getting hanged just because of the Google Chrome web browser. It is so ridiculous that a software as simple as a browser can hang the whole system by utilizing RAM as high as 1.5 gigabytes if around 6 to 7 tabs are open. But in this video, I'll be giving you guys a very important solution with the help of which you can cut down on the memory uh, that Google Chrome will be utilizing when you are browsing. So without wasting any time, let's get started. So as you guys can see, I'm using the Google Chrome browser for all my basic browsing activities. Uh, and when I'm using Google Chrome browser, generally I keep open a lot of tabs like this. As you can see, YouTube is open and some news websites will generally be open. And this type of browsing habit is actually common with most of the users out there. And because of a lot of tabs being open, what happens is you can see the memory that Google Chrome will be using Will be really really high generally when you see the task manager the google chrome will be showing like it is using 60 percent of the memory and uh, power usage will also be showing here as moderate or very high so the solution to tackle all these problems is right here just go to the chrome web store in the chrome web store just search the great suspender so this is uh, the tool that we have to use guys this is the great suspender uh, it has been made by this uh, development team called suspension labs it has an average rating of 4.4 which is really great for this tool just click on add to chrome if you're using any particular tab let's consider this is the chrome web store tab i'm using and there are a lot of other tabs that are open like youtube google news and a lot of other tabs are open on my computer right so these tabs also will be using the memory of your computer in the background so if you're using this tab you will not be necessarily using this tab at that moment as well this tool intelligently determines which is the current tab and it actually suspends all the other tabs that is open and when you switch from this tab to this tab it will automatically reload this tab in the exact state where you had left just click on add to chrome and it will tell uh, add extension just click on add extension and it will take a couple of seconds yeah so the tool has been successfully added to chrome guys so it says thanks for trying the great suspender it uh, i make your computer run smoothly by suspending the tabs you aren't using you can fine tune the settings below so let's go ahead and check the settings of this uh, uh, particular google chrome extension guys there are different types of time options that you can set uh, in order to suspend the tabs automatically suspend tabs after one hour is given over here as default i want to suspend tabs uh, after five minutes let's consider and i'll keep it as five minutes because if i am reading something over here after five minutes this tab gets suspended so that is the thing that we have to do here automatically suspend tabs after five minutes never suspend pinned tabs never suspend tabs that contain unsaved form inputs so let's keep this as a tick suspend tabs that are playing audio so this is very important if you are playing some music or if you are playing uh, some youtube video in the background uh, and and you are browsing uh, something over here so let's keep this tick never suspend tabs when offline that's fine never suspend tabs when connected to uh, power source let's keep this uh, uh, thing as such so another another thing is you can also set a specific url uh, in order to be whitelisted because uh, let's consider if you are developing something on your google chrome web browser and you don't want to uh, suspend that particular tab so you can set that url as well over here and suspended tabs automatically unsuspend tab when it is viewed so this is a very important thing guys 
uh, automatically unsuspend tab when it is viewed like if i'm switching from this tab to this tab it has to automatically unsuspend so that is a very important thing that we have to uh, note apply chrome's built-in memory saving when suspending uh, reduces the suspended tabs memory even more by utilizing chrome's built-in this can result up to 500 percent memory saving when working with large number of tabs let's also use this as well now let's set the theme to dark which is our favorite theme screen capturing is disabled instant suspend when morning no so let's keep all these uh, settings as such guys and now let's test whether this function is working or not so as you guys can see i am uh, browsing this particular tab as of now and i'm reading something on the internet let's consider i'm searching for google news and i'm reading something and after that specific amount of time that you have set inside this particular uh, um you know setting it will automatically suspend the tabs as you can see on the top portion of this particular um you know window you can see all the other tabs has been blacked out if i am opening this youtube uh, the great suspender will reload the youtube application for me instantly and all the other tabs uh, will be blacked out as you can see i'm browsing youtube it came back to the exact state where i was using this particular uh, tab on my google chrome browser so let's try by playing a video so let's consider i'm playing this android authority video and i pause it and i'm coming down over here and all the other tabs has been blacked out and let's switch to google news and it loaded back yes so it loaded back to the place where uh, i have actually left this google news tab and i have set the timings as 20 seconds uh, let's just check whether after 20 seconds this will uh, switch back to black or not as you can see this is the tab we are playing uh, the video on so it has to suspend that particular tab as you can see this just got blacked out guys and it is an amazing amazing thing right now and let's click on this it will unsuspend now and it has to take back me to that android authority video brilliant it just came back to that particular state where i was using this tab on my google chrome let's check with some article um, gadgets.ndtv.com this is a article let's consider this is an article that we have to read and let's open another article on google news and we'll see whether this uh, thing works or not so let's open this uh, s11e article on uh, google news so we have this article from 91mobiles.com and let's consider we are reading this article and we'll switch to gadgets 360 and we'll read this article so when we are reading these two articles this one has to get blacked out see these two tabs has to get blacked out keep an eye on these two tabs guys and one got blacked out second one also needs to get blacked out in a couple of seconds now yep so as you can see these two tabs also got blacked out since these two are in black state this means the great suspender is working on uh, those two particular tabs suspending the memory of those tabs and it is actually saving a lot of memory and it makes your computer more smoother let's check the memory that google chrome is using even though these many tabs are open over here uh, the memory should be less as of now so let's consider opening the task manager and boom as you can see the memory that is being used by google chrome is just 20 percent initially it was 65 percent with the amount of tabs that was open but now with the same amount of tabs we have just 21 percent of the memory that is being used by google chrome so that's it for this video guys if you guys have liked this video please hit the like button share this video with your friends and if you have still not subscribed to our youtube channel you have to hit that subscribe button as we'll be bringing such a kind of amazing tips and tricks and great tools in order to enhance your technology usage experience. Thank you for watching guys.